To make a swipe to delete function like this in iOS with Swift, it's quite easy. And would it be nice if your user can do this? So, why don't you learn it too? Hello guys, welcome to Learn Mac App Channel, where we share our software development videos. So let's dive into the video. We have already created a basic notes, but we haven't created a delete functionality. The very first thing that we need to do is by allowing swipe to delete action in the screen. Hit build and run, and we should be able to do the swipe action. Now, I am going to delete a node data at certain row. And let's see what we got. Notice when we delete, nothing happened. Actually, the corresponding node is already deleted, but the UI is not updated. So we need to update the row since we already delete the data on that row. Let's see what happened after we update the row. Now, we can try to delete a node and the node is disappear. Great. All right, guys, this is how you implement swap to delete functionality in iOS. So thanks for watching and see you in the next video.